We are in the cozy little nook over here on a wharf on the way to Peggy's Cove. <laughs> the ocean is right there. This is the end of the wharf, so we aren't going to be going backwards. <laughs> And we're going to stay on our mats. We're going to be doing a seated series, um, some tabletop things, some lengthening, some strengthening, and also getting a little bit of a stretch in as well, all while enjoying the ocean here. So it's just starting to sit comfortably, really exhaling, letting the breath fully out here, finding full inhales. Full exhales. Really feel free to open the mouth and really sigh it out. Let the breath out as much as you can here. And taking up some room on your mat. So if you're finding sitting cross like it isn't comfortable, you could always lengthen one leg. You could sit on the knees here, whatever you need. And let's take a few more breaths. Feel free to bring your hands on the belly. Maybe one hand comes to heart and to the belly. And just feel your that divine intelligence, that life force energy in your body really filling up. And then coming back into the self, letting go. And notice on that letting go part as you exhale, the shoulders soften. You can breathe to the back of the body a little bit more. You may even lean back enough so the heart is present. Notice if you want the hands down or up here. Really find your breath, find your space. Just taking a few more breaths here, long inhales. Long exhales. Soften the face, soften your jaw, breathe in the back of the neck. Eyes are soft or closed. If you're really enjoying this background, you can keep the eyes open. But again, just using that to soften into the body. Two more breaths. Breathe into the hips and the toes. Gently start to blink the eyes. Open up their clothes. Inhale, reach up with the arms. Eyes can lift, hands come down to the heart. Really nice. Lifting one hand down. Other hand can wrap in behind. So you want to breathe into this open edge of the body. And then start to roll back slightly. So you're using that hand in behind you to say, it's safe. I can open up. I can lean back. Gaze may even come up. And then slowly bringing that arm down. Hand can come down as well. So body is facing this bent knee. Eyes can come down. Just see how much you can fold in here. Eyes can come down. Head can come down. Breathe to the back of the body. Exhale, letting go. On your inhale, slowly rising all the way back up. Come back to center, inhale. Exhale, other side, hand comes down. And remember, we're taking this other hand in behind, rolling it behind us. Hand is here for support. And then trusting that space behind you, eyes can come up. Roll open, wrapping, really wrapping those ribs down and back here. And then closing the shoulder over, finding that side stretch here. Hip is still planted. Eyes can come down. See how much you can fold in towards the self. And then slowly coming all the way back up. Hands come back to the body. Inhale. Exhale. Bring one hand in behind you. Other hand comes across the body. Inhale with purpose. So instead of just breathing and staying, really picturing that you're lifting up and out of the low back. And exhale, squeeze the torso. Squeeze the arrow, twist. Then the eyes can move. Then the head can move. One more breath. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, let it out other side again breathe with purpose lengthen other side hand comes across nice and tall exhale it out eyes can move one 
One more breath. Slowly come back to center. Coming into one more seated pose before we add a little bit more movement here. Just extending one leg out to the side. Other leg is bent in. Take an inhale to lengthen. Exhale, we find that squeeze and twist again. And then hands plant. So maybe you stay here. You could also fold a little bit more forward. Hands that come past the toes, lower. Inhale, breathe a little low back. Exhale, bring that heart forward. Breathe with purpose. Let the head soften. Other side, take your time. Rolling back up, helping the leg come back. And again, we just extend the other leg here. Full inhale. Exhale, twist, folding over. Again, you can reach for a moment towards the toes. Then find a place you can just fold in, letting go, breathe in the back of the legs. Slowly coming all the way back up, helping the leg come up here. Make your way into all fours, into that tabletop position. Hands are below the shoulders, knees are below the hips. Toes can tuck if that feels better for your knees. Inhale, lifting up the heart, tailbone lifts. Exhale, curving in, coming into that cat and cow movement. Really stretch the back of the heart, drop the belly. Heart comes forward, eyes lift, curving in. Starting to plant the hands, tuck the toes, downward facing dog. Drop the head. Really good. You can bend one knee, then the other. Lowering back down to all fours here. Start to lengthen that left leg out. Toes can point. And then just starting doing little lifts here. So the belly is plugged in. Hands are planted. Lifting that foot. Two more here. Really good. Lower down to the forearms this time. Hands plant. And then just drawing circles. So as if your big toe is drawing on the wall behind you or just the air behind you. Really isolating that hip. So you're moving from the hip, the leg, the toes, but keeping the core strong. Doing three more. And then switching sides. Keep drawing with the big toes here. Three more. One more. Really good. Lift. Dropping the toes down so you're crossing across the body. Lifting up. Planting the toes out to the side. Lift up. Planting the toes. So it's an if. You're drawing a, drawing a triangle. Again, keeping the core strong. Breathing in the back of the legs. Pointing the toes. Really good. Gaze is slightly down. Three more in each direction here. Two more. Squeezing the glute as well. Really good. Coming back. Bend the knee. Pointing the heel. As if you're pushing the heel up towards the sky. Raising out the leg as much as you can. And doing five more here. Four. Three. Two. One. Release down. Come back into your child's pose. You can move the head side to side, open the knees if you need to, pause and breathe. In your next inhale, coming back to tabletop, other side here. So we're lifting and lengthening the right leg, adding those little lifts, belly, is pulled in and up here, pointing the toes. 
Again, you can feel in that hip, the glute, strong leg pointing out here. Two more. And then we make our way to those circles. As if you're drawing behind you. You can stay here in all fours or feel free to lower down to the forearms. Whatever feels best here for you. And just doing three more on this side. And when you're ready, lift and then switch, doing those circles on the other side. Gaze is slightly forward and down. Don't forget to breathe fully in the back and the front of the body. Two more. And then we pause, bend that knee, lengthen the leg up, bring it back down. So you're like pushing out through the heel as if you have energy on that heel, reaching up and back, breathing through the glutes here. Push up. Three more. Three, two, and one. Really good. Lower the knee down, child's pose. Hands could come in behind this time. Slow your breath. Let it go. Really good. Slowly coming all the way back up. Coming into seated here. Bringing the arms out to the sides making little circles and then switching. Really good. Then pretend that you have a little ball here and you're bouncing it up and down as fast as you can. Really good. Bringing the hands together, lifting the elbows and arms up, lower down. Doing five more like this. Engage your core. So good. Opening up and then moving the elbows, the fingers, the backs of the shoulders. Very good. Slightly leaning forward. Palms are behind you. Bring the arms out slightly so you're making almost like a Y shape. And then moving the arms up and down. As if you're stretching the fingers as far as you can behind you. So good. Release here. Roll that out through the body. I hope that's really awakened your core, setting energy through your toes, the arms, and everywhere. Doing a full body yoga and pilates here take another big inhale exhale release coming into one more pose feet come out in front of you take a big inhale lift the heart exhale folding here hands to stay on the body or planting two more full breaths Long inhale, long exhale. Gently coming back to seated. Legs can recross, eyes can close. Just pause, letting that settle into the body and just notice how different you feel in your mind, how much more inspired you feel, how your body feels. More of gratitude. Soften your jaw. Hands come together in front of the heart. Take you a moment here to list three things you're grateful for. 
And remind yourself how fortunate and abundant you really are. Grace, love, and gratitude we bow forward to ourselves and each other. Say namaste. Open your eyes as you're ready. Thank you.